Hello everyone, and welcome to Platinum Cappers. Today, we're diving into an intriguing MLB matchup as the Kansas City Royals, with a 65-55 record, head to Target Field to take on the Minnesota Twins this Wednesday afternoon at 1.10 p.m. Eastern Time. This game isn't just crucial for postseason positioning but also showcases a clash between two formidable teams, making it a must-watch for fans and betters alike. The Royals have been holding their own with a batting average of .254 and an impressive 128 home runs this season. Despite this, they've been involved in a series of high-scoring games recently, with the last seven all topping the expected runs line. This could be a key factor today as they face the Twins. Minnesota, on the other hand, has been strong at home. They boast a batting average of .253 and a slugging percentage of .428 indicators of their ability to power through games, especially at Target Field where they have dominated recent encounters with the Royals. Today's pitching matchup features Cole Raggins for the Royals, who brings a solid 3.27 era and over 140 innings of consistency to the mound. His performance will be crucial as he faces the Twins lineup. Opposing him is Louis Varland for the Twins, who has struggled this season with a high era of 6.46 in just over 30 innings. Varlin's challenges this year could turn the tide in favor of the Royals if he doesn't manage to keep their hitters at bay. The odds are favoring the Twins slightly in terms of the spread, but the total set at 7.5 reflects expectations of another high-scoring game. This aligns with the recent trends from both teams, presenting an intriguing scenario for betters. Historically, the Royals have found it tough going in Minnesota, losing nine of their last ten games at Target Field. Meanwhile, the Twins have capitalized on their strong home form, winning eight of their last ten games there. This dominance at home and the tendency for games between these two to exceed run expectations suggests we could be in for an exciting game. Given the current dynamics and historical data, I'm leaning towards a Twins victory with the game total going over. Minnesota's strong performance at home and the Royals' struggles on the road paint a clear picture. For those placing bets, Consider the Twins to win and for the game to be a high-scoring affair. Thank you for tuning in to Platinum Cappers for today's game breakdown. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more insights and predictions. We appreciate your support and look forward to seeing you in the next video. Hello everyone. Welcome back to Platinum Cappers. Today, we're diving into an exciting MLB matchup happening on Wednesday, August 14, 2024, at 3.40 p.m. Eastern Time. The Colorado Rockies, who are struggling this season with a record of 44-77, are set to face the surging Arizona Diamondbacks at Chase Field. The Diamondbacks are doing significantly better, holding a commendable record of 68-53. The Rockies have found it tough this year, especially in converting hits into runs. Despite their 133 homers, they've only scored 514 runs, a clear indicator of inefficiency at the plate. Their pitching hasn't helped either, with a whip of 1.52 and an ERA over 5. The Diamondbacks, in contrast, are thriving with a .261 batting average and 629 runs scored, thanks to a more potent offense and a relatively stronger pitching staff with an era of 4.46. In today's pitching matchup, we have Tanner Gordon for the Rockies, who is struggling with a 6.15 era and three losses from his starts this season. The Diamondbacks will counter with Jordan Montgomery, who despite a high 6.37 ERA, has managed a more respectable record of 7-6. This shows his resilience and ability to secure wins under pressure, a crucial factor today given the Diamondbacks' impressive home field record. Looking at the odds, Arizona is clearly favored to win, with a money line of minus 204 compared to Colorado's plus 170. The Diamondbacks are expected to cover the 1.5 runs, reflecting confidence in their ability to dominate at home. Arizona's recent form supports this, having won five straight and eight of their last nine at home. Given the dynamics between these two teams, my pick for today's game leans heavily towards the Arizona Diamondbacks, predicting a final score of 6-3 in favor of Arizona. They have the lineup, the pitching, and the home field advantage that makes them the stronger team in this matchup. Thank you for tuning in to Platinum Cappers. If you enjoyed this analysis and are looking for more insights and predictions, make sure to like, subscribe, 
and hit that notification bell for more updates. We appreciate your support and look forward to seeing you in the next video. Hello sports fans! Welcome back to Platinum Cappers. Today, we're diving into an intriguing MLB matchup between the Pittsburgh Pirates and the San Diego Padres, scheduled for Wednesday, August 14, 2024, at 4.10 p.m. Eastern Time at Petco Park in San Diego. This game is a tale of two teams heading in opposite directions, and it's one you won't want to miss if you're looking for some sharp betting insights. The Pittsburgh Pirates come into this game struggling to find their footing this season. With a batting average of .235 and an on-base percentage of .302, they've shown some flashes of power but have been inconsistent in getting runners on base. Their 941 hits and 117 home runs so far aren't enough to cover up for their offensive struggles. On the pitching side, they've been decent with a team era of 3.94 and a whip of 1.29, but it hasn't been enough to compensate for their lackluster offense. This trend mirrors what we've seen in other National League matchups, like the Athletics-Mets game today, where teams with inconsistent offenses struggle to stay competitive. On the flip side, the San Diego Padres have had a much more successful season. With a .265 team batting average and a slugging percentage of .417, the Padres have racked up 571 runs from 1,088 hits, including 136 home runs. Their pitching has been solid as well, with an era of 3.98 and a whip of 1.23, making them a formidable opponent, especially at home. Their recent form, winning 9 of their last 10 games, and strong performance against National League opponents, as seen in matchups like the Astros vs. Rays game, indicate they are a team in control. On the mound for the Pirates is Mitch Keller, who has been one of the few bright spots for Pittsburgh this season. With a 3.56 era and a whip of 1.22 over 136.1 innings, Keller has shown the ability to keep his team in games with 123 strikeouts and good control. However, he'll be up against a potent Padres lineup that can punish any mistakes. For the Padres, Martin Perez will take the mound, but it hasn't been an easy season for him. With a 4.78 era and a whip of 1.51 over 96 innings, Perez has struggled with consistency. While he might find some opportunities against a struggling Pirates lineup, his performance will be critical in determining the outcome of this game. The current betting odds favor the Padres, reflecting their stronger season performance and recent form. The spread is set at minus 1.5 for San Diego, and given their solid batting and pitching lineup compared to the Pirates, it's easy to see why. The total is set at 8 runs, indicating a belief that this could be a relatively low-scoring game, especially with the Padres' strong pitching staff. When it comes to betting trends, the Pirates have been on a downward spiral, losing their last 9 games straight. Their road and National League records are particularly weak, making a bounce back in this contest seem unlikely. Meanwhile, the Padres have been on fire, winning 9 of their last 10 games and maintaining strong home form with a 6-1 Sioux record in their last 7 games at Petco Park. So, what's the play here? With the form they're in and the solid stats to back them up, the Padres look well positioned to keep their winning streak alive, especially at home against a struggling Pirates team. While the money line is a safer bet, there's also value in taking the Padres to cover the spread. As for the total, given the strong pitching and the recent trends, the under might be the way to go in this matchup. For my final prediction, San Diego Padres 4, Pittsburgh Pirates 2. Thanks for tuning in to Platinum Cappers. If you found this breakdown helpful, make sure to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell for more expert analysis and betting tips. Good luck with your bets, and we'll see you next time.